Hey, what's up guys? You're here with Gordon from Pink Dogs and you are here for your free picks from German Bundesliga on Saturday, February 11th. Six games on the schedule in Bundesliga, guys, for Saturday, kicking off at 9.30 a.m. and finishing off at uh, 12.30 uh, p.m. Eastern. Uh, we have some very exciting matchups going on. We have a couple of big games as well. Uh, so make sure you check these out, guys. Get your free picks. And uh, if you want more free picks, there's a lot more videos up on the Big Dogs YouTube channel, guys. So check it out. Subscribe. And, of course, hit that like button. That does help us a lot. Uh, we are going to kick it off, guys, with this Mainz versus Augsburg matchup. We have two kind of struggling teams right now. Two teams that have been uh, a bit of a hot and cold as of late. Especially Augsburg, who's been playing... Uh, we lost, we lost, we lost for a while now, and uh, now it's time for a loss, to be honest. Mainz uh, hasn't been doing that good of a job this season. They have been struggling with consistencies. Uh, they have only two wins at, at home so far this season, alongside four draws and three losses. However, uh, Augsburg hasn't won any of their last six games on the road. They have actually lost their last three games on the road in a row. I think that Mainz is the better team here, and I think that they are underperforming severely. And when we add the fact that Augsburg is missing a, like five or six players that would be in the starting lineup if they are not injured, uh, I think that Mainz absolutely deserves to be the favorite here. And I'm going to take advantage of this prize, guys. I'm going to take Mainz on the money line. It's minus, 120, uh, minus 124 right now. I think that they are the better team here, and like I said, uh, they are underperforming a little bit, and uh, with a nice win at home, their confidence should uh, kind of rise, and uh, they should become a little bit more consistent. In the second game in Bundesliga, guys, Hoffenheim is hosting Bayer Leverkusen, and this is the debut for Hoffenheim's new head coach after the previous one got fired. Uh, because, well, let's be honest, Hoffenheim has been struggling defensively. They have been desperate. They are on a five-game streak without a single win while losing their last three games in a row. Uh, on top of that, they got knocked out of the DFB Pokal by Leipzig, and since that was pretty much their only chance to get a trophy this season, that is out of the window right now. Uh, Leverkusen is also on a two-game losing streak right now. They have been struggling defensively quite a lot, and on top of that, they weren't able to score a goal against Borussia Dortmund, or against Augsburg, who, let's be honest, uh, neither of these two teams are great defensive teams. So, uh, Chubby also has to do something to step out this losing streak. However, I'm not sure it's going to happen here. We know that when the team changes the coach, uh, the players tend to give a little bit more in the first game just to prove that they belong on the pitch, that they should be starting 11. And I think that's what's going to happen here with Hoffenheim. Uh, we can see that they are a bit of an underdog here, but... That's uh, just a very good spot for a double chance here. So, guys, I'm going to take Hoffenheim on the double chance at uh, minus 148, which is also a pretty good price because we are covering two out of possible three outcomes with this pick. And, uh, like I said, the price is pretty good. So, I'm going to take Hoffenheim on the double chance here simply because they are getting a new coach uh, for the first time uh, in, in this game. And, like I said, the players tend to step up their game when this is the case. So... Hoffenheim on the double chance. Well, guys, Bayern is looking to keep their winning streak alive. And uh, after beating Wolfsburg in Bundesliga this past week, it was 4-2. And uh, even after conceding a red card, they scored a goal. Uh, before that, they have beaten Mainz in the DFB Pokal 4-0. So it kind of looks like that Bayern is going back to their old goal-scoring goal ways. Uh, they are creating a lot of chances, uh, as they usually do, but they have become a little bit more effective in their last two games with eight score goals. Uh, defensively, they are still a bit shaky, and Bochum has been scoring goals pretty consistently, so they might get to the scoreboard here. This is one of those games where we have to look for a price, where we have to look for a pick a little bit deeper, and uh, seeing how Bayern is playing in the Champions League against PSG next week, I think that they will try to put this game to bed as soon as possible. Uh, get to the scoreboard as soon as possible so they can maybe arrest some of the players in the second half and for that reason I decided to go with uh, Bayern's team total in the first half over 1.5 goals at plus 102 which basically means that Bayern has to score two goals in the first half doesn't matter if they concede or not they just have to score two goals in the first half 
uh, for us to win this pick and I also think that they are gonna do that by like the 25th or maybe even 30th minute uh, like I said they will try to put this game to bed as soon as possible and uh, focus on that big Champions League matchup they have ahead uh, if Bohub gets something out of this game good for them if not I don't care as long as Bayern scores two goals Freiburg is hosting Stuttgart in the next matchup guys and they are one of the teams that has been so inconsistent since the restart of the season uh, the first game back they lost 6-0 to Wolfsburg second game they got a point third game they got a win and then again they lost to Borussia Dortmund 5-1 luckily for them they were playing in the DFB Pokal earlier this week they got the nice 2-0 win it was harder than expected uh, but a win is a win and uh, Certainly, it's going to be a nice confidence boost for them. Stuttgart on the other side is now uh, in, in that 16th place, which is still the relegation zone, and uh, they are still without a single win on their own this season. However, I think that I personally think that Stuttgart is a very good team, team that has uh, a lot of quality, but they have been hit by injuries this season, same as the last season. Uh, luckily for them, they did enough last season to stay in Bundesliga, but I'm not sure they're going to be this lucky uh, this season. They, they have to get some momentum, they have to gain some consistency, but uh, it's going to be a hard thing to do against this solid Freiburg team. Now defensively, as we can see, Freiburg has their own issues, uh, but so does Stuttgart. And for that reason, guys, I think this game is going to be uh, very fun and very entertaining, where we're going to see a lot of goals. So I'm going to take over 2.5 and minus 114. I'm not going to risk with both teams to score, because... It's sometimes it happens that uh, that the teams get shut out. Uh, it happened to Freiburg, so I'm just gonna stick to over 2.5 minus 114. Very simple pick at a very good price and uh, should be a very fun game to watch. Werder Bremen is hosting Borussia Dortmund, the team that uh, has been on the roll, the team that has been scoring a lot of goals, and the team that's actually on a nice uh, six or seven game winning streak right now. Uh, if we if we count uh, those friendly matchups in the off season, uh, in their uh, DFB Pokal game earlier this week, uh, Borussia Dortmund has beaten Bochum two one, while before that they have beaten Freiburg five one in Bundesliga. They have kept the clean sheet against Leverkusen. They they won that game two 0 and uh, they are simply very very superior team to pretty much everyone in, in Bundesliga this season. Yes, Borussia Dortmund has their offensive, their defensive issues. Sorry, and uh, Werder might take advantage of that uh, because they do have the quality to get to the scoreboard against anyone. Uh, Werder is now on a two-game winning streak. Actually, they have kept a clean sheet against Stuttgart. They have won that game two 0 uh, Before that, they have beaten Wolfsburg two one, and uh, they are becoming more and more consistent. They are creating better and better chances, and it's been paying off to them. So. I think that Werner as a home team here has a case to be made here uh, and uh, they definitely have the quality to get to the scoreboard which I think they will. So in this one guys I'm taking both teams to score and over 2.5 goals at minus 137. I would love for this price to be a little bit closer to even money but sometimes we just gotta bite this, uh, bite the chalk and uh, kind of take the price that we are offered so, and in, in this case this is minus 137 so I'm gonna go with it guys and we are closing Bundesliga day with this Leipzig versus Union Berlin matchup we have two outstanding teams two teams on a nice nice winning streak uh, and two teams that are the closest to Bayern Munich so far this season Union Berlin is uh, in second place with 39 points which is a point less than Bayern has but overall they have been incredibly consistent as of late they have won every single one of their games since the restart and uh, they are actually now on a 1, 2, 3, 4, 6, 10 game winning streak. Now they have been conceding goals as of late which might be a good sign for Leipzig but honestly I do not think that uh, Union Berlin should be the other as they are. Plus 380 on a team in second place on a team that has one of the best defenses in the league. I just don't see it. I, I don't know what the books are thinking about this game, but we are definitely not on the same same wavelength here. Uh, Leipzig is a great team. I think that they have a lot of quality. I think they have a lot of offense. Their defense has been solid for, for the better part of the season. Uh, 
they are still undefeated at home and that's probably the main reason why they are such a big favorites here but in this case I gotta side with Union Berlin I gotta give advantage to them because they have been in amazing form I know that this winning streak has to end at some point but uh, Leipzig is, is missing a few key players and uh, that is gonna be an issue for them when they're playing one of, against one of the best defenses in the league so in this game guys I'm gonna take advantage of this price and I'm gonna take uh, Union Berlin on the double chance at plus 108 any time the books are giving us plus money on the double chance on a team that's on a high winning streak the team that's very close to the top of the table i'm gonna take it and in this case i think it's gonna pay out at this nice price so i'm gonna take union berlin on the double chance at plus 108 that's it guys this was the last game of the day in bundesliga uh like i said six games on the schedule uh should be a, a nice and an and exciting day in, in germany a lot of goals a lot of chances in all of those games so uh get your readers here guys if you want more free picks go to the pig ducks youtube channel of course check them out uh any sport you might like you want a nba you want hockey you want uh you want your super bowl picks or or whatever go go to, go to the pig ducks youtube channel and get them guys that's it good luck with your bets and uh, i'll see you soon with more free winners